This molecule is calcium modulated protein, or calmodulin for short. Calmodulin is a protein that assists in calcium signal transduction, which is the process by which cells communicate with each other using a cascade of calcium mediated reactions. Calmodulin is able to sense the changing concentration of calcium ions within the cellular environment and mediate further binding of proteins by accepting calcium ions in its four binding sites, thereby activating the intermediate protein. Calmodulin is ubiquitous in all eukaryotic cells and is most often found in the cytoplasm. This ribbon diagram demonstrates the dumbbell orientation, called the halo conformation. During calcium signaling, the protein is able to take this form in order to take part in essential function. This second conformation is known as the APO form. This is the form in which calmodulin is inactive due to the absence of calcium in the binding sites. We see that as the calcium ions are introduced to the environment during calcium signaling, the ions are able to bind in the four binding domains. This activates the protein, exposing the central tether or linker region. Activation of the protein allows the protein to take part in continuing the process of calcium signal transduction and therefore assists in tasks such as nerve signaling, skeletal muscle movements, and memory recall. These functions are deeply reliant on the change in conformation because they can only be carried out if the protein is activated from its APO form, lacking calcium ions, to its halo form, shown in this figure. In the same activated ribbon form of the polypeptide, we can distinguish between the bonding and the non-bonding parts of the protein by coloring them differently. Shown here, the purple regions contain the sites in which calcium ions bind during an increase in concentration, shown as white atoms, whereas the light blue region represents an area of the protein that will facilitate protein-protein interactions to continue the cascades of reactions that is calcium signal transduction. As mentioned before, this alpha helix is called the central tether region. The flexibility of this alpha helix allows the polypeptide to bind to over 100 target proteins, but this affinity for protein-protein interaction hinges on the binding of calcium ions within the four domains. While converting to its halo form, the calcium ions must be brought into the binding sites and bind with several ligands in a characteristic pattern. This pattern is known as an EF hand motif which is found in proteins that interact with calcium ions. This graphic is an example of the structure of an EF hand motif, where the calcium ion acts as a central metal bound to six ligands in a heptadentate system. In this example, the calcium ion is coordinated with two glutamic acids, labeled E, one of which is coordinated through a carbonyl oxygen, shown as a dotted line, one asparagin, labeled N, two aspartic acids, labeled D, and one water molecule, specifically the oxygen atom. The structure of a calcium binding site in calmodulin is slightly modified from this example, but it maintains most of the same components. The calcium ion in calmodulin is coordinated with three aspartic acids, one glutamic acid that interacts in a bidentate fashion, one carbonyl group from the backbone of the protein, and the oxygen atom of one water molecule from the environment. The collection of ligands that construct the binding site may lend an idea of why calmodulin is selective for calcium. Only the presence of a calcium ion can satisfy the binding site that causes the protein to activate, and we will see that this is related to the concentration of calcium ions within the cell and how calmodulin responds to an increase in concentration. In comparison, a magnesium ion, colored in yellow, can interact with the four sites of calmodulin. One can notice that the calcium ion shown is larger than the magnesium ion. Calcium is below magnesium on the periodic table, 
Thus, it possesses an additional valence shell compared to magnesium, making it larger. This remains true when comparing ionic size. This size difference contributes to the selectivity of calmodulin for calcium. Because calcium ions are larger in size, the ligands are spaced farther apart. If magnesium ions are contained within the binding sites, the ligands are forced to be closer together, increasing unfavorable steric interactions. The decreased steric interactions are why the larger calcium ions have a stronger affinity for binding within this site compared to smaller magnesium ions. Before calcium ions flood into the cell during calcium signaling, calmodulin is likely bound to magnesium, but the protein remains in the inactive conformation. Only calcium ions have the ability to activate the protein from its apoform. form. When calcium signaling is not taking place, the protein is non-functional due to the fact that the central tether region is not accessible. As the name suggests, during an increase in calcium concentration during signaling, calmodulin senses this change in the cellular environment and the calcium ions outcompete the magnesium ions, successfully binding within their appropriate sites of the polypeptide. The calcium ion, which is considered a hard metal, nudges into the binding site to coordinate with hard oxygen atoms of the amino acid side chains and water molecule to resume to its active form, and the central tether region is accessible to partner proteins. The heptadentate system that is formed in a distorted octahedral geometry with the calcium metal surrounded by seven donor atoms is considered a polydentate system. This makes the polypeptide a chelator, which is a term describing a ligand's ability to interact with more than one donor atom. This affinity for polydentate coordination indicates that the coordination bonds in the binding site are strong, offering a sort of scaffold support to the protein's form. The transition between the APO and HALO forms of calmodulin must occur very quickly. This efficiency is achieved thanks to the liability of the calcium ion. Calcium ions possess d orbitals but have no d electrons in their valence shell. In other words, Ca2 is a d0 metal ion. Therefore, calcium ions have a ligand field stabilization energy of zero. In terms of LFSE, stable coordination systems have negative values. This means that the calcium ion is labile and the coordination bonds can be broken and reestablished quickly and efficiently. This is important when considering how often and how quickly the proteins must convert their shapes to forward the cascade of calcium signal transduction. Calmodulin, based on its structure and the composition of its vital binding site, plays an integral part of innumerable processes carried out by eukaryotic cells. Through the accepting and binding of calcium ions in signal transduction, calmodulin acts as a pivotal component of basic and high-level functioning in organisms such as humans. By applying biochemical theory and grasping an understanding of the delicately monitored environment of a eukaryotic cell, one can properly comprehend the ability of calmodulin to select for calcium ions and encourage further functioning involving more than 100 partner proteins.